let's talk about adding fractions. Now, whenever you add or subtract fractions, you have to have equal denominators. And notice here, the denominators are equal. So I can set this as the common denominator, and this means I only have to add the fives. Five plus five is 10, and 10 divided by two is five. But now let's say we had two fractions like this. In this case, we do not have equal denominators. So what you can basically do is take the two denominators and cross scale both the fractions by those denominators. So basically you'll get something like this. Now notice all you did was take this two and multiply it by the numerator and denominator of the left fraction, and then took the 13 and multiplied it by the numerator and denominator of the right fraction. This works whenever there's not a straightforward way to scale denominators, and we're not breaking any math rules because you could just cancel the twos and cancel the 13s and end up with the same expression we started with. Now what I'm going to do is multiply these numbers. So we have two times two over two times 13 plus five times 13 over two times 13. I'll end up with four over 26 plus 65 over 26. And now I have equal denominators, which means I can set this as the common denominator. Four plus 65 is 69. And this fraction does not reduce any farther, which means this fraction is the answer to this problem.